Yay. What's up, guys? We're live. Oh, I already lost that. That was fast. That's okay. I got the impact I wanted. How's it going, guys? Just in the zone for my latest tops card, which I will get, which I will show you guys. I also just posted on Instagram. Man, it has been a minute. Great to see you all. Brian, Matthew, Grant. Grant in the building. Brian, what's going on? Matthew Burke. Oh, man. Yeah, it's been a while since we streamed, guys. So I'm glad that uh, glad to be back. Glad you guys are here. And I will be doing more live streams this week uh, from the National. And we'll talk about kind of the schedule that I have planned. But uh, we're also just going to get into some painting tonight, which I'm excited about. Uh, what's up, Chris? Three days till trade night. That's right. That's right. Jake, what's going on? Uh, no, empty canvas. Uh, I don't I don't do any prep on it besides take it out of the plastic. Kev, what's going on? Big Kev in the house. Sydney, what's going on? Uh, yes, yeah, so we're going to be painting uh, uh, George Meekin. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Uh, painting tonight, commission for Grant. Shout out to Grant, one of the OG stream team. Like super, super OG. Uh, so we're going to do that. And uh, what's up, Tess? And then while, uh, like in between layers, when paint is drawing, we will uh, talk through some of the plans for the national. I pick up my uh, rental car at 7 a.m. tomorrow. And we pack it up and we're trying to hit the road by like 9 or 10. It's myself, Mike, and, uh, and Matt. And we're having a very, very good uh, – we're excited. We have a great, great trip planned, a lot of cool, cool little events and activations, especially the trade night, which is going to be on Thursday night uh, at the Hyatt O'Hare, just like attached to the convention center uh, at a conference room there. And then I've got a few other events. Like, like I said, we'll talk about when paint's drying. Uh, I'm going to give you guys a, a, a peek of my latest tops card. Hence the, uh, the outfit when I first came on. We got a little, uh, let's see here. Come on, all the way over, all the way over. Bobby Valentine. So I did a little, uh, we did some photos today. In case you guys want to take a screenshot, this is the time for it. Mm. There we go. How'd I do? <laughs> They won't stick to my actual mustache. Uh, yeah, so pretty stoked for this card. However, uh, Tops is still working to get the rights for Bobby Valentine. I don't know for sure if he's going to get them, but I just wanted to do it anyways. Uh, I have uh, some great photos uh, with Bobby when I was a kid at spring training in, in uh, Sarasota, Florida. Actually, the same, uh, the spray, same. I believe it was the same fantasy camp as um, Brooks Robinson. <clears throat> Speaking of Brooks Robinson, I had a phone call with Brooks uh, a couple weeks ago when the card was live. Went great, very nice, very sharp, and I'm going to send him some cards. But I haven't even, I haven't gotten my Brooks Robinson cards. I was really hoping that I would have those before the national. Hopefully have some chase cards. Um, I know I haven't seen anyone get a chase card uh, yet, but I have a feeling maybe that they're sending the, the chase cards out separately in separate packages other than the main print run. I don't know. Mine just still is stuck in processing. So who knows? Um, yes, Jackson, it's a ginormous card. That's right. Uh yeah, very much looking forward to the trade night. Um, uh, so it's, I mean, it's being organized as a trade night for Project 2020, Project 70. Uh, it's going to be myself. Uh, FDOT's coming. Lauren Taylor is coming. And I know Ben Baller is going to be at the National, so I'll definitely invite him uh, as well as DJ Ski, but I have no idea if those guys are going to show up to the trade night. But it's just going to be hanging out. Um I'll be doing autos there. Uh, I'll have a bunch of like cards and prints and things um, and just excited to meet you guys. And if you guys want to trade stuff or trade with me, I always like to trade. Um, we have like our whole living room is just 
packed to the gills of boxes that we're bringing. We're bringing a lot of stuff. And I actually, I would love your guys' opinions. I have a huge collection of Project 2020 cards from other artists. Do you think that I should bring any of the cards from other artists? If so, are there any cards that you're looking for that I should pack? I've got, uh, I've got everything. So let us know. Um, for the most part, I'm bringing my own stuff, but we'll definitely want to maximize the, uh, the giant car that we have and bring a lot of stuff. Jason, what's going on? Tim, what is up? Um, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, I haven't seen any chase cards. Yeah, I, I would guess with the Brooks Robinson chase cards that they're shipping them separate. Uh, like they did with um, the Mike Trout autos that they launched when my Mike Trout P2020 card came out, all shipped after the original base cards. I don't know why these ones would ship separate because they're just a base card that are not signed by a player. But if I had to guess, that's what's happening. Um, Kev, I'm bringing a, an abundance of Kofaxes. Definitely got you on that. Um, BR, B Ruins, Bree Wins, Bree Wins. Uh, yeah, book a flight. It's going to be awesome. Uh, I think trade night, I would say, is what I'm looking forward to most to. But I'm also just looking forward to just meeting everyone, uh, whether that's a trade night or just like walking around the convention. And uh, you will see our squad decked out in these hats. These are brand new hats we got for the National with the new logo. Uh, I haven't sold any of these yet but we have a handful, we have a box of them that we're bringing with us. And then I also got some of the more traditional um, BJ Auto freaking hot in here. Uh, the other hats. I'm finally retiring this red hat. It's like, it's pretty dirty. And honestly, it's pretty smelly. And I've worn this a lot. I love like, I love the red hat. I ordered a bunch of red ones this time. So I have kind of a few, a few to switch back and forth between. Uh, Matthew, you're going to see stories. You can watch live streams. Yeah, it's Relic Hat. Yeah, Relic Patch of that hat would be uh, pretty dope on a card. Uh, Tim, I'm excited to meet you as well. It's going to be great. All right, so we're going to start painting George. Um, let's see here. I think we'll basically just do it right here so I don't have to move the computer too much. Oh, this is also cool. Ronaldinho, this was done special for the National. He's going to be at the National. I'm gifting this to him. I'm going to dinner with him and a, and a small group of people, and I have a bunch of prints in the living room that we're doing uh, signed prints of Ronaldinho where he'll sign the prints and, and we'll sell them together, which is super dope. Uh, he will probably, after that collab or launch or whatever, that'll probably be the biggest athlete that I've ever, I've ever worked with. He's massive. Soccer is just globally such a big sport quite a bit bigger than uh, everything else I've done so far so that's exciting um, let's see here any other updates uh, we did we launched a round of regular just like card mystery boxes which still have a chance at art but it's not um, yes Kevin I'm going to the Ronaldinho dinner um, which, by the way, is at Nobu, which I'm very excited about. Like, I I love seafood and sushi, so just excited about all of that. Um, we did uh, we did the, the latest round of mystery box that we launched. All of those have shipped, all the orders up through today, as well as all the elite boxes from the last round um, that we did. That those I think we closed those off, I don't know, a few days ago. Um, but those all... Uh, yeah, Kevin, it's, it's a super expensive, um, per seat, but I, because I did the art for him, I was able to finesse the seat, uh, which is great. Um, and the guy, Damien, who is organizing it is a friend of mine who is commissioned, um, commissioned some work. We've been friends for a few years before the, before the tops thing, uh, you know, we're friends from Twitter. It's pretty, pretty amazing that he can make that happen. Ronaldinho is a megastar, and to get him to fly to Chicago for something like the Nationals is really cool. 
Amy, what's going on? Kristen, hello. Octavio, four leaf cards. Dope, dope. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to get to painting. Um, I guess we could go either way. I could uh, play royalty free music, and it's going to be the same stuff I always used to play uh, for you guys if you guys want music, or you guys could do your own music, and I can just kind of be talking, um, and you guys do your own tunes. I'm down either way. Uh, thanks, Kev. Yeah, I'm, I'm really excited about it. Uh, and I grew up playing soccer too, so it's just, um, it's fun to be finally dipping my toes into that world and starting at the top, which is really cool. Uh, all right, so I'm just gonna start painting. We're gonna do it here on the easel. And I'm still kind of up in the air about the music. If you guys, let's see here. Let me see if I can find that old OG playlist. Um, where's Apple Music? Here it is. Bam. Oh, da -da. What am I not signed in? Songs. Hmm. Interesting. I don't even know how to sign into my own Apple Music. How do we do this? Preferences? Advanced? Yeah, I don't know. You guys are going to be on your own for music, I think. Is it possible to play something for you to hear and something else in your earbuds? Probably. Um... Yes, Amy, trade nights can be dope. Yeah, Bobby Valentine. Um, man, I thought I had uh, I thought I had the playlist on this computer, but it looks like I'm signed out of this Apple Music. Let me see if I can find. Uh, uh, maybe if I go to YouTube and then I search royalty free playlists. Let's see here. All tracks, royalty free, no copyright music playlist. All right. Well, we can try it. Oh, it's just one song. Oh, is it? Uh, yeah. All right. Well, I don't know what to expect, but here, here we are. Music, all right, painting time. So we have the uh, 
you guys a little bit of play. Okay, good. There's another song. Sorry. So for this uh, George Meekin card, it's got this blue, bright blue background that we're gonna we're gonna do. I taped off the side so that we have like a border. We're doing it like a giant card. I already have all the stencils cut. I can't remember. I see it four or five layers. And kind of like a lot of my tops cards, we're gonna do pretty true to the original card, but with part of him kind of coming out of the border. We'll kind of see when we lay it all out where that's gonna be, but it's gonna be dope. Anyways, back to painting. Grizzlebees, what's going on? Chris Jones, hello. Nice. All right, back to painting. Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh, we'll let that dry for a little bit. In between, uh, in between coats. Yeah, it's a beautiful. It's a beautiful blue. And it's like, I think it's even cooler in person. Um. Yeah. So let's talk about. Uh, let's talk about uh, the national a little bit. So we have. I'll stop this. I'll stop this music actually for a second. And probably put this over my stand so it just flows all the. Uh... Try and get the uh, the fumes blowing straight out the window. Uh, all right, the national we've got. So we're leaving tomorrow morning. Pick up the rental car at seven. Pack it up. Hopefully hit the road by 9 or 10. I think it's a 12-hour drive from us. I'm very excited for a road trip. I don't get to drive a lot in New York. And I actually enjoy I enjoy long, long drives where I can get lost in a book. Uh, not like bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic. So, like, I'm, I'm glad to not have a car here in the city. I would hate driving around New York. But I love the idea of getting out of New York and just going on a road trip. Uh, myself, Matt, and Mike are going to pack the car to the to the gills. F dot is coming by in the morning and dropping off some some merch, and we're going to shuttle that to uh, to Chicago for him. And then he's flying and meeting us there. Lauren Taylor is also flying in. Um, excited about that. I haven't met her in person yet. And let's see. The first thing that we're doing. Let's see here. Did the whatnot thing ended up on third on Wednesday or Thursday? I forget. Tess, I gotta look up. I gotta look it up. Whatnot? I think it's on Thursday. Thursday. Okay. Okay. So on Thursday is when my events start popping off. Wednesday we're just gonna be uh, walking around meeting people. And then on Thursday at 11 a.m. is my first uh, official event, which will be at the Whatnot booth. Um, I think you guys have bop, uh, popped in on some of the Whatnot auctions um, that we've done. It's a live auction platform, mobile, mobile uh, app. And I'm going to do a live auction at their booth, auctioning off the huge, some cards, some art. And uh, that's from 11, 30, 11 a.m. on Thursday until 12.30. Then I have a little break for lunch. And then at 3 30, uh, Lauren Taylor and I are both doing an appearance at the like a meet and greet at the top booth. It's gonna go for about an hour from 3 30 to 4 30. And then Thursday night, and then I have a little break for dinner. And then uh, Thursday night we have the trade night, which I'm probably the most excited about uh, of all the events at the national be this trade night and i'll probably set up my laptop and do like a live stream so you guys can tune in if you're not able to make it in person um that is from 9 p.m until midnight you don't need a ticket or anything for that um i mean it's nice if you are so and tell us you're coming so we know how many people are coming but uh yeah nine to midnight that's gonna be awesome that's at the hyatt and then uh, Friday is up in the air. I think Friday night, I think, is the Ronaldinho dinner. Kev, maybe you know better than me. I don't even remember what day it is. I think that's on Friday night. Um, so that's just a random thing I'm doing Friday. But uh, otherwise, just generally, like, walking around the conference. Um, then Saturday, uh, I have a live painting event at the Pristine Auction booth. And they apparently have a huge booth. They said they're right next to Panini. Uh, and I'm doing live painting from 1 p.m. until 5 p.m., roughly. And I'm going to be painting three paintings, start to finish, uh, kind of simultaneously. It's uh, it's actually, you guys have seen it a, long, a while ago. I did a partnership with them for uh, Magic Johnson, Nolan Ryan, and Bo Jackson portraits. And we're doing prints of those which are going to be sold i thought those were going to launch a long 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 time ago they haven't yet and um 
I'm going to be painting the same, those same stencils from the things that are about to launch to try and build some hype. And then we're actually going to give away all three of those original paintings are going to be, uh, I don't know if raffled, raffle is not the right word because it's free to enter. Um, they're going to be given away. And Pristine is setting that up too so that even if you're not present at the show, you can still enter to win those three original paintings. Uh, and then Saturday, just uh, wandering again. And then I don't know if there's anything happening on Sunday, but at some point on Sunday, we'll pack the car up. Hopefully, we won't have much to pack. And then we'll head back here. Uh, and then I'll be here in, in New York for like a day. And then I'm going to Joshua Tree for four or five days uh, with my friend for his birthday. And same crew that I went to Joshua Tree with a few, I guess that was a few months ago now. But I'm very excited about that because the National is going to be uh, definitely a work trip. And then as soon as I get back, one day to unpack, fly out to LA, turn my phone off for three or four days. Um, and just recharge and relax. Chris asked, what am I looking to pick up at the national? Uh, handshakes and hugs primarily. Um, I will definitely, uh, tag the entry on my Twitter. Uh, I will promote it for sure. Uh, thank you, Kristen. I appreciate that. Four leaf cards Thursdays. Thursday is a great day. Try and come through uh, in the evening. Grant, I will ship your painting during that day. Don't you worry. Um, yeah, Four Leaf, if you're coming by, Thursday would be a great a great day to do it. Um, yeah, Kev, I think the dinner is Friday. Exactly. Exactly. All right, we're going to do another coat of that blue. Let's see how this is shaping up. We'll get this music. Uh, Brian, will there be a meetup for those who may not make trade night? If you guys want to organize it, sure. Um, I mean, if people are gathering, I will come. Uh, but I'm not organize. I'm not personally organizing another like specific meetup outside of the different booth things that I will be active at. So, if you can't come on Thursday to trade night, you could come Thursday morning to whatnot or. Uh, Thursday afternoon to Topps booth or Saturday afternoon the pristine auction booth. And that's definitely where I'll be. Saturday at the casino, I like that. Nice. Yeah, Four Leaf, you should definitely come by Thursday night. It's going to be, I think it's going to be worth it. Get this back out. Fortunately, I have multiple cans of that one because I just went through an entire can of it.
put this over by the fan again to try to speed dry it. All right, favorite baseball player, Zeh. Uh, Mark McGuire and I guess Buster, I mean, Buster Posey for sure, um, as far as current. I mean, Brett Phillips is a new, a new favorite. He seems like a really good time. All right. Yeah, those are kind of my baseball guys um, in terms of uh, – oh, let's see here. Okay. Sorry. We're um, – we have a ton of flowers. We got some beautiful purple flowers uh, for this dinner that we had. Uh, I guess that was last week, last Wednesday, last Tuesday, something like that. And since we're leaving, the flowers still look beautiful, but I don't want them to go to waste. And they're probably going to die during the five days that we're gone. And so there's a, this guy, Ron, who's a bartender at a bar and restaurant like right next door. And he saw my Instagram post about the flowers saying, does anyone want these? And he wants them. So Ron just texted me that he is closing up shop and uh, it's going to take him a little while. And I said, take his time and he can come and get some flowers. Um, yes, Joseph, what's up? I agree. Trade night is going to be dope. And shout out to Joseph. Joseph made this whole thing happen. Appreciate that very much. And um, it's going to be great. Uh Let's see here. I'll just try to play a little catch up on some comments. Yeah, Britt Phillips does seem like a good dude. Nice. Ooh, Spider Man 300. Amazing Spider Man 300 for Tim. Yeah, it's going to be a blast, guys. I, I can't wait to meet, meet a bunch of you guys in person. And like I said, for those that aren't able to come in person, we'll live stream as much of it as we can. Uh, and, you know be taking a bunch of selfies together and posting on Instagram and whatnot. Um, it still looks a little shiny. It's not quite dry yet. I'm going to take a look at the stencils and, and I'll, I'll go ahead and pick my colors, I suppose. Let's see. So we got our orange ball. Light orange. There we go. Here's our color selections. Oh. 
four. Okay. Almost showtime. Thank <laughs> you. 
So far, so good. All right, we'll wheel it over and let it dry again. I'll be right back, guys. Need to get another beverage and use the bathroom. See you in two minutes. All right, and we're back. <sighs> Sydney, that would be dope. 1951 Mickey Mantle card sprayed on the spare set of Harley tanks. Grant, you can have the stencils to go with them. That's fine. Nice cash bar at trade night. Good to know. Good to know. Yeah, I think it's in Atlantic City next year as well, uh, which is great. That's close to close to us. If I'm still in New York, who knows? F dot was a nice last minute surprise. Hopefully, we'll have more last minute surprises. Uh, anyone from Project 70 or Project 2020 that's at the National will get the invite. I just don't know who else is going besides me, Lauren Taylor, F. Dot, and then I know Ben Baller and Ski are both going to be there, which when I see them on Thursday, I will invite them to the trade night as well. Nice. VIP bags for the first 50 people. Door prizes all night long. Uh, Joseph also, uh, F.Dot, told me that he would contribute uh, some stuff for giveaways. I'm sure that Lauren Taylor will as well. Pat D's, what's going on? Good to see you. Good to see you. Yeah, follow Beantown Hobby on Instagram for trade night uh, stuff. Joseph, that's a great hit. Oh, that reminds me, I need to, where are my, I wonder where those are. I should bring some cards of myself. I don't have a ton of them, but I have some. I gotta find those. I'm gonna write that on the board so I don't
Gotta look at that reference photo one more time, Grant, and just make sure I get the hair color right. Let's see here. Oh yeah. Okay, good. Nice dark brown. Perfect.
All right, two out of four layers down. Let's see here. Uh, doing good on time. Great. Pat, appreciate you as always. Hey, Riley. How's it going? Very cool. Very cool, Dad. Jake, good to see you. As always, man, catch the replay. You can see how it turns out later. Just playing a little catch up on the comments. Breaks and Bros shares a birthday with Meekin. Nice. June 18th. Happy birthday last month. Yeah, Octavia, you see I left I also left my mustache longer than I shaved everything else. Going uh, it's loud. Um going full Bobby Valentine for the national. Nice. Yeah, I'll be rocking the fanny pack as well. I'm excited to see how many fanny packs we see. <sighs> Excuse me. It'll be great. Uh, let's see. I always wish paint dr dried, drew, dried faster. Let's see where we're at. Ready for more. All right, white layer.
closer. As you guys know, because you guys have seen, you guys have mostly seen this before. The black layer, which is next, is really what uh, what pops it all off. So I'm very excited to paint that one, per usual. Game time. Thank you. 
right. There we go. I'm very happy with it. The one thing I think I'm going to do, Grant, is I want to make this ball popping out of out of the frame too. Since that elbow is in front of the frame, the ball's in front of his hand. I think that should be out. So I'm gonna I'll do it off off of a live stream. But before I ship it to you, I'm gonna finish the uh, the bottom the bottom little bit of the ball. Any other little touch ups that that need done uh, if I see them. But uh, Kev, I actually I already have your silver Griffey painted. Um, I could bring it to the national. I'm gonna write it on my list right now of things to bring to the national. Bam. Now it's on the list. Thank you, Grant. Uh, appreciate the support. And uh, yeah, it's a fun one. And I think it, I think it came out really good. Looks a lot like the original card. Slash could be a top card. Uh, Project 2021. Thank you, Pat Dees. I appreciate that. Uh, yeah. Thank you guys. Um, really appreciate everything. Glad you guys came and hung out. Very excited for the national. I am going to uh, pretty much call it uh, after saying, you know, some closing statements because uh, I do have to get up super early to pick up our uh, rental car to drive to Chicago tomorrow. I've got a long drive, so I want to get want to be well rested, rested. Yeah, Matthew, it does feel like the good old days. We might have to we might have to bring it back more often. Um, I actually have, uh, uh, I hired a consultant, he's a friend of mine, but he does live streaming, like big live streaming productions, uh, daily. His company produces live streams for like Reddit and NASCAR and like some big clients. And so he's, we already did one consultation of like setting up this studio to really be doing like nice live streams with camera switches, kind of like how I envisioned for 23 live. And we kind of, we, we, we learned, <laughs> um, but yeah, I appreciate you guys all, uh, hanging, uh, hanging with me tonight and appreciate you, especially Grant, uh, for the support and excited to get this shipped off to you. Like I said, I'm going to do, I'm going to do a couple final touches. I don't know if I'm going to do it tonight or when I get back from the national, but I will ship it to you after I'm back from the national, before I go to Joshua tree, I'll get it in the mail to you. But it's pretty much it. What's up, Dad? How's it going? Good to see you guys. Yeah, it was a fun stream. Uh, I missed this, and uh, like I said, maybe we'll we'll roll back into streams more often. Um, other than that, I'll see you guys at the national. I'll be posting uh, my schedule on all my social media channels, and also just. Uh, uh, like things as they're happening. I'll be tweeting, you know, Twitter's my best news source. Uh, that's right, Dad, you came in late. You can always go rewind. We we painted that start to finish in just over an hour, which is uh, pretty solid. Love it. Granted, you know, a lot more hours were spent cutting all the stencils, but uh, very happy with how it came out. Anyways, I appreciate all of you guys. Uh, Excited to meet some of you in person at the National. And if you can't be there in person, hopefully you can tune into some live streams and uh, enter some sweepstakes contests like the, the pristine auction one. You don't have to be present to win. And that's going to, we're giving away three original paintings. Anyways, uh, thank you. Stay awesome. And I'll see you guys soon.